You know, when I was a little kid, I had no clue about what dad did. I just knew that whenever we went somewhere, everybody wanted an autograph, a picture, or like, oh, Don Rafa, it's an honor to meet you. And I was like, wow, my dad is so cool. He's cooler than yours. <laughs> <laughs> After you learned about March 1st, 54, did that change your relationship with your father? Of course. Some of the things when I was a little kid then made more sense. He would always be in state of alert. For example, when he would take me to eat, I would always notice that he would sit in a way that he could look at the exit. And he would say, hijo, siempre mira para todos lados, like always look everywhere. But he was always so loving and gentle and kind. So I remember asking him like that, how on earth did you grab a gun and started shooting people? 